For patients with acute pancreatitis, management guidelines recommend early aggressive fluid resuscitation, yet evidence supporting this approach is limited. A new trial compares aggressive resuscitation with moderate hydration in adults with acute pancreatitis. In this multicenter open-label randomized controlled trial, 249 patients who had been diagnosed with acute pancreatitis in the prior eight hours were assigned to aggressive or moderate resuscitation. With the aggressive approach, patients received a 20 milliliter per kilogram bolus of lactated ringers solution over two hours, followed by infusion at a rate of 3 milliliters per kilogram per hour. In the moderate resuscitation group, patients with hypovolemia received a 10 milliliter per kilogram bolus over two hours, and all patients were infused at a rate of 1.5 milliliters per kilogram per hour. In both groups, patients were assessed at 12, 24, 48, and 72 hours, and fluid was adjusted as needed. The primary outcome, the incidence of in-hospital moderately severe or severe acute pancreatitis, did not differ significantly between the groups, at 22% with aggressive resuscitation and 17% with moderate resuscitation. The main safety outcome, fluid overload, occurred three times as often with aggressive resuscitation as with moderate resuscitation. Secondary outcomes, including organ failure and local complications, did not differ between the groups. The authors conclude that among patients with acute pancreatitis, aggressive fluid resuscitation did not improve clinical outcomes and was associated with a significantly higher rate of fluid overload. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.